past few centuries, the industrialization and rapidly increasing population of the human race has taken a huge toll on the Earth. With satellite imaging, we've been able to document the changes on the Earth's surface caused by urbanization, deforestation, desertification, erosion, and changes in the flow of water. Air and water quality have also been tested in numerous regions, showing a decline due to pollution. Deforestation is the removal of trees and vegetation for human exploitation. In modern times, it has become exponentially more evasive and a large problem. From 1990 to the year 2000, an estimated 343,047 square miles of forest land was destroyed worldwide. The most recent decade saw a major decrease at 200,773 square miles, but still devastating nonetheless. A recent example was the use of Agent Orange in the Vietnam War as a part of the chemical warfare waged by the U.S. Spraying Agent Orange destroyed an estimated 25 million acres of forest land, an area about the size of Kentucky. The Aral Sea is considered one of the planet's worst environmental disasters. In the early 1960s, the Soviet government began to use the two rivers that fed into the lake for irrigation and agriculture. In the subsequent 50 years, the lake has all but disappeared. The grim outcome is documented by satellite images taken over the course of the past few decades. A once great lake is now a barren wasteland with only small slivers of water, abandoned ships, and a destroyed fishing industry. We have seen multiple examples of artificial land reclamation, which is man-made land expansion into the sea. Hong Kong Disneyland Resort and the new Hong Kong International Airport were both built and reclaimed land. Pollution is also a major issue created by industrialization and urbanization. Disasters such as the 1986 nuclear meltdown of the Chernobyl power plant in the Ukraine have left lasting effects on the environment to this day. The area is still uninhabitable. Oil spills such as the 1989 Exxon Valdez spill in Alaska's Prince William Sound, the 1991 Kuwaiti oil fires, and the recent 2010 Deepwater Horizon spill in the Gulf of Mexico have released billions of gallons of crude oil into the environment, causing devastation and earth-changing effects. Modern cities such as Los Angeles, Mexico City, and Shanghai have very poor air qualities. While some of these effects can't be undone, we can reduce our environmental impact and improve efficiency by being good stewards. With rising populations, if we don't make good efforts to lessen our environmental footprint, there will be no resources left for future generations. Thank you for watching.